I have a 2004 Moto Guzzi 750. It's a Breva. It's experiencing a problem that a lot of Moto Guzzi's experience, and that is you turn the key on, you hold your clutch down, and you go to start the bike, and all you get is a click. Or sometimes you'll get nothing, or sometimes you'll get a couple clicks, and then it'll start, and it'll seem really labored, and this is how I fix that issue. I wanna make a quick note. You're gonna first obviously wanna eliminate the battery as a culprit by making sure you have a fully charged, good battery that's giving the starter enough juice to crank. So that click that you hear when you try to start it is coming from this little guy right here. And that is the relay for the starter solenoid and the starter. Now what's happening is basically the way these Italian bikes were wired is the electricity that comes from the battery has a really long path to get to the actual starter itself. And that path actually causes so much resistance as these bikes age, you know, the connections get a little imperfect or whatever, that there's a huge voltage drop and the starter can't turn. So what you're gonna need to do is take this, this is a starter relay, you're gonna wanna look at the red wire and I'll refer you to a schematic if you wanna check it out yourself. And you're gonna wanna cut that wire pretty simple process you tape off this end of the wire and then you're gonna take a wire and run this red wire directly to the positive terminal of your battery so I ran a jumper wire directly to the terminal of my battery there I haven't soldered it or finished it yet but this is just a proof of concept and we're gonna have the bike on and then let me see if I can set this up so you can film it well let's see we're gonna go to start it and see if she turns just like that. No click. It turns right over. So I'm just going to go ahead and finish up those connections and that'll be that. Okay, so here's my final product. Just to recap, I've cut my red wire on the starter relay, which is on the far right on the 750 Brevas. I tapped in my own wire and put it straight to the positive terminal of the battery. And I just did a crimp connection here and a little extra electrical tape. Here I did soldering and a lot of electrical tape and uh, shrink wrap because I'm not very good at soldering. But that should be all you need to do to get rid of your click problem. I've got the bike on already. I try to hold in the clutch and press the starter button. It spins over like a champ, like it never did before when I owned it. And it's that simple. So hopefully I won't get stalled in the ghetto anymore. Not that I don't like being in there, but I don't like being stuck there. Uh, thanks for watching my video. I hope this can help you guys too. Just a quick little hint, the other end of this wire that I'm gonna tape off, you could also use as the hot wire for a switched accessory. So just put the hot wire here and then ground it somewhere and that will be a switched on accessory. I'm not gonna do that, I'm just gonna tape it off, but you have that option. And again, thanks for watching my video. I hope this helped you guys out. I want to point out that these Moto Guzzi starters uh, are notorious for going bad. I actually had that happen to me a little while back. The starter on the inside just literally tore and ground itself up. So I had to replace it. I got one from, I believe it was called DB Electrical uh, off Amazon or their website. It was pretty cheap. It was like 50 bucks. It's pretty easy to install. It's only held in by these two bolts and a couple connections here. So if your starter is your issue or if you're just curious about it, it's definitely worth popping your starter off and taking a look. It's not that hard.